Hello, everybody in Little Fukuoka. Welcome back to some more Dead by Daylight. Moving over to some killer games. Hopefully, we'll get a few. If not, then um, to right to custom game kind of thing. So, I've got my random wheel of selection. I've got all the killers on the wheel, apart from, well, the Skull Merchant, because I'm still currently leveling her up as I speak. So, you will not you know, see me suffer playing this killer. Quite of yet, because, you know, I still haven't got decent add-ons with, you know, the Skull Merchant. So, it is what it is. There's always the next time. So, right. Ah. Uh, First killer is going to be Trapper. Good old Trapper. Let's load up the other wheel for our first perk. Rolling it now. And it is going to be. In fetch is right. In fetch is right. There it is. Alright. Second perk is going to be Awaken Awareness Awaken Awareness where is it? There it is for our third perk is Hoarder Hoarder uh I know I have it somewhere. Right. For our fourth and final perk. No way out. No way out. So, okay. For a quick reminder, so if that's just right, awaken awareness, hoarder, and no way out. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Right, I will load up the other wheel, wheel for, you know, the next match. I'm not going to roll it just yet. So the challenge for all of you, well, my challenge to all of you, to those who play Killer, is obviously how, how well are you going to do with these perks? Will you get a 4K? Will you get an OK? Or will you simply do okay? <laughs> I don't know. We'll have to wait and see, won't we? It doesn't matter what add ons I'm bringing because, you know, like I said, you can use any add ons if you want. As long as you're playing the same colors as I am. And if you let me know on how well you do. In the comments down below, see if you did better than me or more poorly than me. At the end of the day, it's just a game. I'm not forcing anyone to run these books the same as I am because, let's face it, it just makes things a lot more interesting, don't you think? And, well, let's just say it was an old friend of mine's idea when, you know, something that we used to do, what, last year? 
Um, so... That should be interesting. And I figured, you know... I might as well redo this. I might as well redo it. Yeah, because it's a challenge, and I'm challenging on New Year. So... Uh, I've actually got a lobby. <laughs> Well, this should be interesting. Well, for me at least. I don't really play Killer that much. I may still be rusty still. <laughs> we'll see. But, um... Hmm. Took a while to find a match, but... Like I said, I don't really play killer that much. So we have Ace in the Wonderland. Ace, good old Leon S. Kennedy, Fei Ming, and Cheryl. If you're wondering what the S stands for in Leon S. Kennedy, it's Scott. Leon Scott Kennedy, to those who don't know or do know. To those of you who probably play Resident Evil 4 <laughs> too much. But, um, you yeah. know, I mean, to be fair, Resident Evil 4 is probably, like, the best game out there for the Bag Village and Resident Evil 7. I mean, Resident Evil 7 does have its sort of, you know, grievances, you know, relying on the same enemies, but at least with Village, they gave you a different variety. I didn't, you know, offer McMillan because, you know, I want the game to pick it for me. Because I want it to even be more challenging. So, you know, like I said, you don't do it have to the way I I do it. But like I said, if you want to take up the challenge, um feel free. Um, let me know how you did in three of these matches or two of these matches. Um, like I said, it's been a while since I've done it because, you know, I've been focusing a lot on Survivor lately. You know, getting all my gen trophies out of the way and done with, I think I still have two gen trophies left. Um, Shelter Woods and... Oh, what's that other map called? The Knights, you know, map trophy thing, whatever it's called. I don't have an offering for it. So, so anyone who knows or has been to that map too many times will let me know. It would be much appreciated because I still need to get that gen trophy. And once I get those two gen trophies out of the way, then I'll be doing, um, you know, Death Survivor Trophies, because I tend to, because, let's face it, they're a lot more harder. That's a bit slow there. What's going on over here? Me wonder. Nothing. No one's working on agenda. I'm sorry, Cheryl.
Are you alright, Ash? I don't think you're alright there, but... You know... Someone's messing around with my traps. I can put pick up a trap here. I don't need it anymore. Oh, Cheryl. I leave you alone for a few seconds. Nice. Three gens left. Oh. Two gens left. Hello, Ash. Ah, wrong locker. I think he just tried to dead out me there. Ash, what are you doing? Hello, Cheryl. Nice try. He grew it all though. Someone just screamed. I think that was Leon. <laughs> One down.
Sit down. Why did you show DC uh, moments after, you know? Fuck you now. Come on, Edge. One generator left. I don't think I really like to. But drop it just in case. <sighs> I mean, fair play to you. I mean... Hmm. All I can say is that they pretty much screwed up here. Finally, someone makes a move. Hello? Hey, thing.
Who's that? I just saw that as well. Hello? Ah! Hi, Leon! <laughs> hmm. All right, she's over here somewhere, but I don't know where. Might as well pick this trap up. Can't literally I. Oh, I see scratch marks. I have no idea who this is, but... Okay. Cool. GG's, I guess. Yeah. I give it. I'm giving it a solid three out of five. <laughs> All right, Ian. Two people disconnected me, disconnected on me for some reason. All right, time to find out the next kill. Hey, it's Freddy. Good old Freddy. For our first perk. Blood Warden. Interesting. For our second perk. Brutal Strength. Interesting. For our third perk, Devour Hope. Well, there it is. For our fourth and final perk, is Iron Grasp. I am grass, but I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Okay. So to recap, Blood Warden, Brutal Strength, Devour, and I am grass. Alright, what add-ons do I want to use? Palace and... Eh. I might as well offer party streamers. This is double blood and all that. Well, it's also. Alrighty then. Right. There we go. The next wheel is ready to go for our third and maybe possible last match for Killer. We'll have to wait and see that.
Dun, dun, dun. Alrighty then. So we have another thing. We have a Nia, a David, well, two Nias and a David. Let's go. This should be interesting. Again, if I'm yeah, I'm all for you know Leon escaping because he deserved the escape. Again, I have no idea why that thing they seen, and I don't mean to you know um, tunnel anyone from the last game or draw my attention on certain survivors. It's just that then yeah, let's just say that Ash was in the wrong place at the wrong time. And Cheryl was just, you know, being Cheryl, I suppose. Even though, yeah, yeah she was doing generators. Hello, David. Well, did I? Should have expected that from David. How did I miss that easy down? <laughs> uh. Yeah, uh, she's got alive. You gonna stand there? I know what you're gonna do. Ooh. 
Hello, Vang. I heard that running footsteps as well. No, my TV is gonna turn down. I hear running. Hello, David. That didn't go too well, did it? Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, David. Mia wants that tone.
And she got out. GG's. <laughs> GG's indeed. Right. On to the next killer whale. Uh, killer wheel. Whale. <laughs> uh, I'm surprised. Yeah, Devourer lasted a little bit longer than I thought. I, I knew that he would find it eventually, but um, let's just say I got a little bit protective of that totem. So, yeah, a little bit. But either way, uh, on to the next challenge. That challenge is, you know, done. Time for the third and final killer of the video. Oh no. Oh no. Well. It's the night. Come on down. I'm not very good with knights. So, right, our first perk. It's Deadlock. Where's Deadlock? Dead, 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 dead. There is. Second perk. Surveillance. It's all the way out the back. Uh, surveillance, 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 surveillance. There it is. For a third perk. Hex Ruin. Oh, God. Another Hex in the build. And finally, for a fourth and final perk is superior anity that's at the back as well superior superior okay so to recap deadlock surveillance ruin and superior anity um This should be interesting. Even though, yes, I did play the night before, but that was in custom game. This is in a proper server, so I'm expecting a huge gem rush here. So, yeah. Found a match pretty quickly. Nice.
I probably won't be able to use his um, ability too much. Oh, look at all of them, look, flashlights. They're all getting ready to blind me. And the funny thing is, I can't change my perks. Once the wheel has spoken, and like I said, the rules are pretty much, you know, um, if you accept these chat, I should, yeah, mention the rules as well. Uh, once, you know, you accept my challenge and, you know, run the build that I've been running for the last two matches, including this one, you can't change the perks. You have to literally see the match the whole way through. I'm not joking. So, um, even though I'm tempted to, you know, put Nightborn on, the perks have been locked in, the wheel has spoken, I can't do anything about it. I know I'm going to get gem rush. So, all I do know is that I'm going to hit um, the block cap at the end of this match, so that's a good thing. I definitely would say it depends how this match goes, because, you know, there are never certainties with Dead by Daylight. And I definitely would say out of the three, I probably would say the best one will probably be the Freddy one. Um, of course, yes, that New Year T bad me out the gate. Fair enough. Um, I'm not too annoyed about it because, like I said, a lot of people do it these days. And, you know, it's a GG's in my book. I'm not too, you know, bothered about it. You know, I don't really care. I should have hooked that thing. But, um, I don't think the door would have been hoping them time. So, yeah, it is what it is. So, I, I can't really complain too much. At the end of the day, they did a pretty decent job. Uh, they got all the way down to one gen. <laughs> Hello, Feng. Was that dead on? I mean, that was dead on. Nice. Nice. No wonder why she went out in the open like that. Not this time. I'm so sorry. I heard running. I saw that dead out of animation as well.
I was about to kick that generator as well. This is going pretty swimmingly. I saw scratch marks. Where am I going? See, the funny thing is... Bend in the heel. Oh, hey Bill, fancy meeting you. Dead on? No! I think that was dead on. Well, you're dead, Vang.
Well, it's been fun, Adam, but I'm afraid it's game over. And then level two. Any day now. Yeah, I think they've pretty much screwed up here. <laughs> Hmm. That's the game up. Well, so sorry, Bill. I'm afraid you put up a good game. But I'm afraid it's sadly over for you. GG's! Hey, two more trophies. <laughs> so, with that being said, 
I definitely will say that the Freddy match and, you know, the night match, I was expecting a huge gem rush from the other survivors because I don't play nights. But, um, I definitely will say with a bit more practice and understanding, he could be a pretty decent lethal killer in the right hands. I was, I'm kind of curious to see if anyone, apart from Feng, Huh. So Feng and Gear are the only ones who run in dead hard. Alright, fair enough. Did I have fun? I'd give it a 5 out of 5. But with that being said, um, I hope that you enjoyed um, these three matches. Like I said, do you accept? I'm like I'm kind of curious. Do you accept my little challenge of mine? Do you think you can do a little bit more better um, than me? Um, so, you know, the bar and the question has been asked. And let me know how, how well you did with this challenge of mine. Of, with the Knights, with Freddy and with Trapper. Until then, I'll see you all in the next video. Take care, have a lovely weekend. Until the next time, bye bye for now.